When we came up with the idea of doing yoghurt, the main reason we did that was there was no other yoghurt made in Northern Ireland. We're the only yoghurt produced in Northern Ireland, the only one obviously using Northern Irish milk. And that was the whole ethos of the thing was we didn't want to replace another product made here. We didn't want to compete with the guys doing ice cream, doing cheese. So we went for something that wasn't made here. It's very much still an artisan production unit. What we want to do is make a real quality product that people realise the difference between the standard stuff on the shelf. So yeah, we stay to the authentic traditional methods. We incubate our milk slowly overnight with a traditional culture. Our Greek yoghurt is made in the, the original way where we pump the yoghurt into cheesecloth bags. We strain it for an hour and a half and what's left inside is true Greek style yoghurt. Lots of companies thicken with creams, milk powders, gelatin. Ours is absolutely authentic, whole milk, nothing else added. It really surprised us actually at the start. We, we saw it as a breakfast product, which it is used a lot for. But when we looked at, at data from uh, Tesco club cards, we found that the most common ingredient in the basket, along with our yogurt, were actually herbs and spices. So it's been used a lot, our, our natural and Greek style has been used an awful lot in cooking of curries, stroganoffs, all those types of products. And I say it, it actually surprised us a lot. We were expecting to see mueslis, honey, that type of thing being bought with our product. A lot of savoury cooking going on with the product, which it's great. It gives a real opening in different markets. Uh, we obviously have added now and we do our strawberry yogurts, raspberry, blueberry, Madagascan vanilla. They're more of a dessert and breakfast product, but our traditional natural and Greek yogurt extensively used in cooking. My favourite thing with it probably is actually, you know the brockgammon guys with their goat? Curries made and uh, a bit of yogurt added to the curry at the end. Absolutely beautiful.